What is going on guys, DBG here. In this video, we are going to be doing a game play of NBA Live 19. So basically, we are going to, in this game, we are going to play a game of court battles. And the reason why I'm using court battles is because I'm pretty sure it's a one game mode where I can actually use this player. Well, I'm guessing there are other game modes that I can use them, but it's the easiest way I can use them and it's the way I know to use them best. So. I'm gonna go, let's go battle now. And let's see what team's court we are going to play. So there's a load of like, obviously, um, better courts than people on my friends list. I'm trying to think of who on my friends list will have a decent court. Is there anyone really? j -Bo's court is quite good. E8 overall, but to be fair, he is an NBA Live player. Afro Pigs is terrible, but again, I'd say he just played the demo. I'm guessing the same with FaZe. I'm guessing the same with Nick. Shump. Now Calder on fan for life. I've already lost Rizzo Caldies. So now it's just playing as Afro Pig. Like. And let's go. Difficulty level normal. Okay, so I'm going to change my lineup. So. I'm going to put in a power forward. I'm pretty sure I have Porzingis. Yeah, so I got Porzingis as a stretch big. Play him a power forward. I hate the way it takes so long to load. But uh, the re I'm trying to think. I'm going to play this guy at the two. And it's the reason why I'm making this video. So we've actually got quite a nice couple of players anyway. And the person I'm putting in is the Professor. So we've got the Professor in as a two guard. Magic Johnson at the one. We have got my, my player in at the three. Or... My the one player, we got Porzingis at the four. We get Joel Embiid at the five. This is not too bad a team. All 87 overall or higher. And we should be quite good. And it's like realistically the first and only chance we're going to be able to, well, the only game mode we're going to be able to use the Professor in anyway. So uh, if there is any other game modes, leave it in the comments. But I think this may be the only way. So we're playing against a WNBA, two WNBA players. Uh, we're playing against Kevon Looney, Gerald Green, and D Wilkins, whoever he is, Def Fake Dominique, maybe. There's, there was like Marquise Johnson, who was Fake Dominique in uh, NBA 2K19. Maybe this is Fake Dominique Wilkins here, even though obviously it's not. But um, yeah, now let's just get into the game. Okay, ones and twos, first we'll have win by two. We should be good. We should be good. Yeah, let's see what the professor can do dribble moves wise. See, can I do any of them? Okay. Oh, what the hell did I just trigger there? <laughs> okay, as you guys know, I'm really, really bad at dribbling in video games in general. I don't think I'm any better in life than I am in 2K. Good job. Get the professor. For three, green light. That's it, one, isn't it? Yeah, unfortunately. Not the worst thing in the world. Okay. Got semi open there, and <laughs> the professor knocks it down. Let's go. Why not? Let's pull it. There we go. Nice shot there. My dude's a beast, to be honest. And the professor is nice. Maybe it's just because it's on low difficulty, but he feels so easy to. It's just so fluid in all his movements. Which, to be fair, like with NBA Live 19, the real player movement. I don't think it's as big as like the NBA Live fanatics are making it out to be. They're saying it's like the reason why the game's better than 2K, but like everyone's entitled to their opinion, but I don't think it's anywhere near as big a thing as people are making it out to be. But it's definitely it's definitely good. Like the dribbling definitely feels fluid. It's just when you do get stuck into a lot of animations, it feels a lot less fluid. Like your moves, when you are putting together combo moves, it feels a lot more lifelike and a lot less like a video game, but is what it is. Go past Porzingis, bad release, and it's off. Can he dunk? Maybe he can, just not there. All right, we're gonna win this very comfortably anyway. Steal Porzingis. On the break, green light, let's go. Professor puts it up, and he wins the game with it. Honestly, no, he doesn't, sorry. That's only 10 to 11. We're good though, we're 10-3 up, it's game over anyway.
Defense, Porzingis. Let's go. Oh, nice move. Nice move right there. The professor to the basket, and he wins the game. Let's go. Let's taunt. Let's taunt. Yeah, that was a good game there by the professor. At least, like, I know the hype's not the biggest thing because they don't play that much court uh, battles, but at the worst, I get a little bit of XP there. And uh, I actually, I kind of want to do um, a live event because I do want to unlock the professor's dribble moves for my my player. So, rather than using the professor in this game, I'm going to be playing against the professor. So, let's go to create a challenge versus the professor. I kind of want to get all of the professor drill moves, bone collector drill moves, and get to use bone collector in my squad as well. That would be ideal. But uh, let's play this event. So, so far we did uh, beat this challenge earlier and we got the professor. We do not have the professor drill moves guard only. Like they look like stuff like that would be insane to use. Like even the small forward ones, that, stuff like that would not be bad at all to use in game. I would not mind any of them. And then this professor, um, the player, was a beast. Is a beast anyway. Great to put in my core battle squad. So these challenges are quite good. Now let's play this event and hopefully we can go and get the win here. It's good. Yeah, that's way, way too easy. Let's go. Let's run a pick and roll. Someone just had a screen. I don't really care who it is. I need to T-Mac. Is it? Or Penny? Easy layup. Okay, the, the professor is giving Bone Collector work in this game. And the professor is continuing to give work to Bone Collector. And oh, come on, as long as the professor, as long as Bone Collector can actually stop the professor, which it doesn't look like he's going to do anytime soon. Need a lot of help defense there. That's pretty much what we need to have any chance in this game. Bone Collector to play some defense. Pass to Kevin Garnett and he gets the easy dunk. Let's go. Okay, come on, stay in front of him, stay in front of him. Oh my god, Bone Collector. Look for that. Take him inside, take him inside. Or just give me the ball. There we go. Can I switch on to him? I just left Beal. Okay, maybe, I think that's a better option. Me just switching on to him. Even giving up the open three. Professor is hitting everything. Got him. Easy layup. Let's go. We now got takeover, so we should win this game. Actually, you get onto him. Get onto him, Bone Collector. There we go. You know, I'm not a good defender. I'm taking that responsibility. Bang. Oh, I thought that was good. Bad release. Okay. We knocked it down. That was a big shot there. He is more than likely not going to take a three. Oh, uh, why can't the professor take the ball up? Oh my god, Bone Collector, you suck! You absolutely suck! With the one play I got at the professor, he came down, nay, or turned the ball over. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to do the challenge again now. Okay, got him. Let's go, easy dunk. Oh, nice Euro step. Nice Euro step, let's go. There we go, I'm on him. I'm on him. There we go, we finally forced a miss. That's what we need to do. We need me to switch on to him every time. Okay, that left me open. Full white, a little bit of a contest, it's off, damn. Bang, green. Big, big shot right there to make it a one point game. I'm double and he's still not willing to pass to Bradley Beal, step back. Oh my God. How am I meant to beat this challenge and the professor's doing, out here doing that? I'm going to finally force him to miss. Get me the ball. Get me the ball here. Get me the ball here. It's an open shot. Bang. Let's go. Just no threes. No threes. That's a two. It's fine. It's a miss. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Bang. Game. Green. Finally. We should have won it the first time, but at least we won it the second time. Let's taunt them. Okay, so let's see who I got in this collection. Hopefully, hopefully, I got the professor's dribble moves for a uh, wing. Then I can equip them. But if not, and I get for a point guard, 
Okay, perfect. Small horde only. Okay, so let's equip the animations anyway. Go to dribbling. Rather than having default dribble moves. I don't know why I didn't even have Kevin Durant's dribble moves equipped. Or LeBron James's. Or Magic Johnson's, which I've had. But anyway, we got the Professor's dribble moves, which should be really, really cool to use. So that's them equipped. Our jump shot is currently... We have Kevin Durant's, don't we? Pretty sure I have Kevin Durant's equipped anyway. Yeah, I have Kevin Durant's equipped. Gonna use that. And I think dunk animations. We use default dunks. Is there any ones we've unlocked? Unfortunately not. So um, yeah, that is the video pretty much. We used the professor himself and he dominated. And then we used, we managed to win the challenge just about for the professor and unlock the professor's dual moves for our small forward, the one player, which should be really cool. So anyway, yep, that is the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.